Hochschule Karlsruhe. You may know me from such movies as What is Sensorix? I directed here in my younger days. Or maybe from the commercial for the Hochschule Karlsruhe here, dressed in my Sunday suit. I am glad to hear that you are thinking about joining the English Master Course in Sensorix. So I would like to introduce the course to you. The lectures are of course in English. Here is Professor Honkus. He's not only holding interesting lectures, but he also works in an interesting lab. In my research group, we are dealing with water treatment technologies for drinking water and wastewater. Uh, water security is regarded globally as one of the most pressing issues in the 21st centuries. In particular, we are dealing with uh, um, water treatment by membrane technology. The most prominent example for uh, um, application of water treatment by membrane technology is desalination by reverse osmosis, so retaining the salt and uh, generating or producing drinking water. And uh, in particular, we uh, are dealing in one of our projects with arsenic removal. Arsenic removal is a very important issue since arsenic is a toxic contaminant in uh, the groundwater of many uh, countries, especially in Southeast Asia. And in Bangladesh, more than 50 million people are affected by high arsenic level in the groundwater. And uh, within our project, we are cooperating with the university over there in Silet. Currently one of our students is over there and uh, he is conducting uh, pilot scale trials in a village near Silet. And uh, so uh, this is really something uh, giving our uh, students great opportunity to uh, proceed what they learned theoretically and apply it in practice. <laughs> Very interesting, but too much water for me. Let us go to some drier place. I heard that Professor Kohler has some kind of heating in his lab. We have installed four different types of fireplaces to investigate if by sensor control of the exhausted gases, the process of firewood firing, firewood combustion, can be improved. This is necessary because, according to the state of the art, the emissions are much too high. I think electro um, sensoric control in general is a good way to get much better protection for the environment and for the climate, of course. On the one hand, we have a situation that uh, using um, firewood as fuel for heating, of course, is a good way because it's a renewable energy. On the other way, the combustion of firewood, of course, according to the state of the art, is not a good way. It's unsatisfactory because the emissions are so high. Going this way, of sensor control, I think we can we can meet both advantages and I think then we will reach that we can use more renewable energy for usage in all, let's say, countries of the world, but uh, with protection for the climate and for the environment. Well, environmental protection is an important issue, but that's not all. Let us see what we have here. What we see here is uh, uh, MRI system which we have installed since 15 years here in the meantime. We have here a magnetic system with a magnetic field of 0.5 Tesla. The system is a very open system which has the advantage that the students has a direct uh, contact and direct view on the various uh, parts of the system. The electronics and the software which you are using is a standard commercial system, which is state-of-the-art. The language in the international research, especially in such a modern field like uh, magnetic resonance imaging, is of course English. And nearly all of the books are written in English and therefore I think it's also a good opportunity to train the technical English in a really very attractive field, the magnetic resonance imaging. Wow! Our university has really interesting projects and equipment. But is this the only reason why students come to Karlsruhe from abroad? Karlsruhe is a little town, but uh, it's very beautiful. So, uh, the air here is very clear, and uh, the people here are very warm to us. Ah! No! I mean, why did you come to study in Karlsruhe? 
Uh, in my university, I also plan to go to go to um, other country to study, such as America and uh, England or or what what any countries. But uh, finally, I I come to Germany because the technology here is very good. And uh, well, after I come here, I find that the professors here are all very nice and kind. And in their lectures, I learn a lot of things. And uh, the teacher here is uh, a very, very uh, professional. And uh, here we got a lot of uh, chance to practice ourselves. The professor and the mentor uh, will give us a lot of advice and uh, uh, teach us hand by hand. In the lab, uh, I think it's, it's the best time. Uh, in German, uh, because uh, in the lab you can communicate with your professor and your supervisor, and uh, if you don't understand something about your la lab, they will discuss with you, and uh, in the procedure of your discussion, you will learn something. I think it's very good. Well, I think these are very good reasons, aren't they? Come and join the English master courses at the Hochschule Karlsruhe, University of Applied Science. And I like the BRC in German. The Weizen beer is very good. <laughs> okay, okay. I will get you some bottles of Weizen beer.